Hi everyone, this is Jana from Hello Germany. In this video, I'm going to uh, talk about what you can do if your current visa or residence title is about to expire and you're not able to get an appointment with your local foreigners authority on time. If you're in Germany on a long-term visa or a residence permit, you probably need an appointment with your local foreigners authority to apply for a residence permit or to apply for a change or renewal of your existing residence permit. And in some cities, this can turn into a major challenge. So for instance, if you are in Berlin, I'm pretty sure that you have come across this problem of not being able to book an appointment with the local foreigners authority, also often simply referred to as LEA. This is also an issue you may encounter in other cities. For instance, in uh, Munich or Hamburg, you can submit your application online through an online tool, um, but the waiting times may sometimes be very long. And if you have not submitted your application on time or if there's um, yeah, a long waiting time, then you may end up in a situation where your current residence title is about to expire and you have not received an appointment yet. It's similar in Frankfurt. In Frankfurt, uh, you don't book an appointment online through a tool and there's also no online tool to submit your documents. You simply have to drop an email to the local foreigners authority and then they will respond back to you with an appointment. Now, if you live in Frankfurt, Hamburg or Munich, of course, the first step is to send out your request either via the online tool or via email. In Berlin, it's a bit more challenging because uh, the first step would be to book an appointment and then you have the appointment, you go for the appointment and you submit your application. But in many, many cases, there are simply no appointments available online. Of course, the first thing I would suggest to do would be to keep trying and to um, try at different times of the day because sometimes people cancel and sometimes you are lucky and there are new appointments going online and then um, you get one. But I know that it's very, very difficult to get one of these appointments online. And I also know that even if you get lucky, you may not get an appointment before the date of expiry of your residence title or your visa. So you may end up in a similar situation um, like persons who are able to submit their documents online, um, but still have very long processing times in other cities. So if you live in Berlin and you're not able to get an appointment, the only thing you can do is to send them an email and I will link a list of email addresses with different departments of the local foreigners authority in Berlin for you. And um, all you need to do is to look for the right email address of the right department because there are different departments responsible depending on your citizenship. And then you can drop them an email with your request, with your application documents and um, ask them to give you an appointment and explain to them that you have not been able to get one online. Make sure that everything's in order in your email. Make sure to um, uh, submit all the documents that you have. Um, and I think there's a higher chance of getting a fast response if everything is in order. At least that's what I have seen in other cases. It's not something I can prove. This is just based on my personal experience. In general, if you don't get a response on time, no matter if you have submitted your application through an online tool or if you have uh, submitted a request via email in Berlin or Frankfurt, the good news is that your current residence title is remaining valid until you get an appointment and until you have submitted a new application. This means that, for instance, if you are here on an EU blue card or a um, student residence permit, um, this permit is going to be valid until you have had your appointment here with the local foreigners authority. But you cannot leave Germany and re-enter if your residence title has already expired. So this is something you should definitely keep in mind. If you are in this situation and um, you have come to a point of time where the residence permit has expired or your long-term visa has expired, uh, make sure to keep a proof of this email submission with you. Um, usually when you submit your email, you get a, like an automatic response or something. So just make sure that you save this somewhere and um, it's accessible for you to have some kind of proof. If you're applying for the residence permit for the first time in Germany, of course, then it's a bit more of a challenge um, because there is no residence permit that can be extended. So in that case, all you can do is to um, wait for your upcoming appointment. 
but in any case your visa uh, is going to remain valid if it is a long-term visa of course in other cases if you've come here on a short-term visa on a tourist visa of some kind this is not possible so what i'm talking about here is a situation where you have entered germany with a work visa for instance or where you're already living in germany with a residence permit that allows you to study in germany or work in germany have you also experienced this problem here in germany do let us know in the comments do share your experiences um, with us i think the more people we have here who share their experience the more helpful this threat can be for other persons who are in this situation and i know that there are a lot of persons out there who are struggling with this especially in berlin so i hope that this video was of some help for you let me know how it turned out and i wish you all the best